When using a graph to determine the period of a wave, remember that the period of a wave is a time property. So on the x-axis, if it is a unit of time, then you're looking at a wave graph. If we travel from one peak to the next peak, we can then calculate the period by taking the time it took for a peak to get from one point to the next point. In this case, two, um, in this case, two seconds to 10 seconds. So I'll take the number 10 and subtract two, which gives us a, <laughs> which gives us a total of eight seconds. Remember when typing in, we're not leaving any spaces. So that would be period or T equals eight seconds.